Hi, and welcome to Budget Meals Under $5. That's right, my name is Brenda, and I'm the host of Budget Meals. I'd love for you to join me, and if you're not subscribed, hit that bell, because you never know what's going to be on my videos. That's right, everything will be in the description box below, and just use hashtag Budget Meals Under $5. You can buy your, your product anywhere you want. Just try to keep your meal under $5. You can make it for one person, two, three, four, whatever. Stretch your meal if you can, or just make it for one person. Make it fun. You can come and go as you would like. That's right, come and go as you would like. This is an open collaboration and I'd love to have you. So. Um, I'd love for you to go over and support all the other ladies and gentlemen that's in this collab. So let me show you what I've got for you this week. Okay. Now, I always say try to think out of the box. Try to stretch what you got. Now, I like homemade, but homemade isn't always possible. So we do what we can, right? So my meal this week came to $4.70. That's right. So what I got was this great value, rising crust three meat pizza. And it's topped with tomato sauce, whole milk, mozzarella cheese, sausage, pepperoni, and beef topping. And the sausage made with pork and chicken, pepperoni made with pork, chicken, and beef cooked from frozen right here and it says it's for six servings seems like everything i get is four to six servings but that's okay sodium 740 calories 330 dietary fiber 2 total sugar 2 includes two grams of sugar and you want to preheat your oven to 400 Remove all the packaging, which is very important, and you bake for 25 to 28 minutes until the cheese is golden brown. Now, everybody's oven is different. So, there you have it right there. Now, I know it's hard to bake a pizza from scratch unless you've got all these ingredients from home. But if you don't have the ingredients, this is pretty inexpensive. Now we used to buy this for $2.78, $2.78, and now it's $3.98 within a year. That's how much it's gone up. I'm just saying. Now to go with that, I purchased some sugar-free chocolate instant pudding. That's right. And all you gotta do is put some cold milk with it, two cups if you've got it at home, dry milk, whatever you have. Buy some of that milk at Dollar Tree. I keep that on hand for a staple. And this says it's for four servings. And um, the dietary fiber is zero. Zero sugar, no included sugar. Um, let's see. Sodium, 400 milligrams, that's about the only bad thing. Total carbs, eight. So we got that. And we have that. That is the budget meal for this week. You got some meat, you got some protein there, you got some dairy there. You know, to try to make all the goodness I can out of the meals. That's all you can do. Well, I hope you join our budget meals under $5. And you never know what's going to be on my videos. Please go over and support the rest of gals and guys that's in this collab. And hit budget meals under $5. And it will take you to everybody else that's participating in Budget meals under $5. Again, my name's Brenda, in case you don't mind know my name. And if you're not subscribed, hit that bell because you never know what's on my videos. Have a great day. God bless. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye now.